night, Thursday the 5th. Bonfire night. Need these today, it's bloody cold. Oh, nice hats. So we're back at Berries. We're getting 40 commons, which I'll now help Alex with. Commons. The rest of the area is the blocks. Yeah. We'll get the bricks at the side. We need sand and cement as well, so we're getting pretty loaded up. We're <coughs> getting sand and cement now. I thought we were getting like a tummy sand. That won't be getting delivered straight away. You need something for today. Oh, I see. Our oh, bricks are still there, look. Oh, yeah. Come on. So, what are you doing here? Uh, I don't know, Jeff. I'm just uh, picking up the, uh, the jab light now, the 125 mil one. Two sheets. Two sheets, yeah. And then we need to go to the Weybridge for the 19 mil. Right. I think. I hope so. Are we getting the um, fiberglass from here or? No, we go for the, the woodshed for that. I mean, are we getting it from? Oh, berries, berries. yeah. Yeah. You've got to know what's where. You get the insulation from the woodshed and you get the polished iron from the Weybridge. It's like, if you don't know where you're going, you need a map. Well, look at the size. That's a tiny part of it. <coughs> so Alex is here, here comes our stuff. I'll move forward and help Alex in with them. Here it comes. Right, it's there goes Alex off for the ticket. Al? Tickets in the corner there. Yeah. If you walk over to the brick shed. Right, I'm heading over to the brick shed. Alex is meeting me over here while I book in the bricks. So we're on the job. Been here about, I don't know, about half an hour, 40 minutes. It's been a long morning. It's uh, where are we getting off? It's 10 to 12. Been to screw fix and topped up with them. Our ties. Got three bags. I think the 12 quid for 25. The good ties, then. So, and then I saw some tape. This is on offer for six quid. So we've got some of that for when we're doing the visqueen. So we've picked up. That's for another job. That's an SK50 for uh, an older job with a smaller cavity. Got all our blues, 180. Uh, we picked up this concrete blocks and the commons. Bit of sand and cement to get us started so we can get this up to DPC today. Just take it around. It's the last of it. Oh, there's our 125 jab. There's still one at home. There's our 19 mil cold bridging strip. That's our new method of how we do it now. With a barrel boot brick. Oh, there's an Alex. So, we're all set. Well, we would be if I didn't forget the die. So, the mortar's died. The garden wall's not, not died. That's sand cement. But the house, I can't work out if that's brown or purple. It's a cool. dark brown or a purple. The extension's been done, it's very light brown. That's dark brown. I don't know if to get some brown and put a bit of black in it just to darken it. So I've got to go off and do that. So while I'm away, Alex can get this vertical damp put in and stuff. Get the rest of the dark ties put in. Get the blower and get the get our line back. It's covered in dust. Yeah. And there's the splash from yesterday. <laughs> yeah, so um, we're all set, ready to go. and We can't start because we've got no dye. So that's another half an hour back, set back. So this has got to be up today. Then Saturday we're going off to do that lintel job that you saw in the van. Sunday we're going to get the, this prepped because it won't be so bad because everything's here. 
we just need to pick up some grit sand for doing the sand blinding and then um, Monday we'll get a uh, Chorley concrete in and get this slab done it's going to be a nice straightforward straight tamp and we don't have to have a stupidly long tamp for this one it needs to be about three and a half meters and then we've got a steels order for there and they're not going in there they're going in into the floor so it's going to be a bit of an awkward one but uh, we like a challenge don't we Alex no. <laughs> oh, so there you go that's the oh yeah concrete's all in and gone off that's going nowhere and that's that's got to be a good six inches thick that for a little tiny wall one two three four five courses and a brick and edge so we'll leave it there for now and uh, get ourselves organized yeah you will yawn it's been a slow day one o'clock we've done nothing finally got some knitting to it luckily <coughs> Alex had the genius idea of going to tool station for the die, so we've done that. So we've got a uh, three brown, which is quite a light brown, which is no good. So I've got a tube a tin of black because we're going for that kind of tone, like a dark brown. So we've put a tiny bit of black in with it. So hopefully this will dry nice. With our little trusty measuring bucket. So let's see how this works out.
Right, it's just gone three. Got that last mix in. That's the door side up. We're going to have a brick and a half pillar. Big door. Three brick pillar. Three brick pillar. But there's a 11 coast dwarf wall first. Three brick pillar. 11 coast dwarf wall. One and a half brick pillar. So, foundations up and down all over the place. You've got a 73mm brick in the corner, then you've got a split, then we've got a flag. So, it's a bit up and down, but as long as it's, as long as it's level when you get to the... And we've got all the dimensions right, it's all squared up, so all diagonals are done. So, we're just going to finish the brickwork off, get the block work up, and then come back Sunday to prep it when it's going to add two days to go off. So, yeah, we'll crack on with this side now. And um, once we've got this side, and we can just string a line across. Don't need to build corners on the inside because it's a, it's a course of brick and a block. So now to it. So yeah, well, that's it for a bit. We might film a little bit now because we haven't done much filming on this one. So we'll put you on normal in a bit. So see you in a bit. You gonna do a little uh, catch up or? I already have some. Oh. So we're on the final wall. So I thought we'd do a bit of normal speed for this bit. And get it in. Here we go. So I had someone in the comments saying, is that one of those stupid GoPros? Yeah, it cost me a bloody fortune, that stupid GoPro. But I highly recommend, if you're getting one, get a 10 like this. Because it's a bigger camera, you get bigger batteries, and the battery life is so much better, way better. What's Oh, um, that barra. Right, straight. Got all the flame <laughs> I don't know what's worse. <laughs> <sighs> Mine's pretty steep, you know. Pardon? My, uh, my line's um, not very steep, sorry. Not very steep. What's that? What about sleep? I've no idea. And then we'll put the frog down, put the tight beds, and that's a very shallow frog, so we're fine. Very shallow frog, which is cool.
Where do you bother that hard look? Mm. No, not interested. So this this sort of work is perfect for you, eh? Yeah. Yeah. We used to do this at weekends. Is it? Yeah, so it's dragged on to them. But now we can yeah, 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 yeah. get it done. I can, I can do the extra dimension of the YouTube. Pardon? I can do the extra dimension of the YouTube. Can I do it? You see that? I think I even said that to the person I met in the night. What's that? About YouTube. I, 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 I didn't do it so I probably swore it. <laughs> <laughs> but I think, I think it, 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 I think it's a good idea. A lot of me, I think it's just for something to do. Because we used to film that to college. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every, every domestic building. Yeah. You're, you're the one that does all the. Well, and, and doing it and we do all the dirty bit. And then Robbie and Robbie. We also do the heavy bits as well, yeah. Yeah. Don't do the steels, really. It's just tight, aren't you? Tight, yeah. I'll just put it. Whoop. Okay. So have you been to college as well now, Alec? Well, sorry? Have you been to college as well on top of this or? Yeah, I did my uh, two years after I left high school, so okay. 2015 to 17. Yeah. And is, is the stuff that your dad does is not right, or the stuff that, that your dad does is... Because you learn different things, don't you? It's a modern way of doing something, your dad will be a bit old, a bit old school and stuff, right? We've just got health and safety around down our throat, so after two good. years. Like, yeah. just common sense stuff, which we then idiots always work, didn't even know. No, no. I was the only one there who actually was there to do bricklaying. Everyone else was there because they failed the maths and English. Yeah. He was the only apprentice in the class. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. how he stays in the building trade. Yeah, it's just like that, isn't it? Tight. Can you tighten that up a little bit? Tighten it up? Yeah. I've worked out a book as well. Yeah, that's the... It's that book, you know, it's been working a bit further, isn't it? So, it's time to go there. It's this unrealistic thing that... Targets. Yeah, it was a no-go, yeah, definitely. Well, Red Row Homes were on about um, reducing the British Apprenticeship to 12 months. Get some of them. Right. I'm going to have it online soon. Do you think so? Yeah. There was an artistry about bricklaying. There was an artistry about bricklaying. It's um, got to like it. And then it's we're probably the most underpaid trade. So. You've heard the plumbers and electricians and that because. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you go from them, yeah, yeah. That's the piece of thing, don't they? It's bad. What have we got? You've got the. Um, the screws? The actual screw head for the plastic bottom. Oh, sorry, the whole inter, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But that build with A&E, we're going down, so they, they've just done one. And they've put, um, they put the plastic board on washers. Well, I can't have a point with that. Plastic yeah. washers I can see, don't they? Yeah. Yeah, I can definitely see the point of that. There's, there's definitely a there's, there's a reason for that. There's a point going that. Yeah. Yeah, alright. Perfect. Continue a bit. Oh, that's alright. I think it, when you're putting the floor in, when you think you do that? Sunday. Sunday. Coming Sunday to get all that back in. Oh, is, that, is that going back in, is it? Or yeah, it's all prepped. So, uh, do you, so you put that in, and then, and then the... Sand. Oh, the cover of sand, and, and, then, and, then, the, and then that sheet. Biscuit. You put the, you put the, so you put the biscuit down first, and then that on top of the biscuit. Yeah. New building reg, you don't like uh, insulation getting soggy. That doesn't get wet. 
it's not like wet in there. I think it's because, you know the other stuff, the, the, um, the dense stuff with the foil back on it? Yeah. I think that stuff what's... Well, that, that's different though, isn't it? That's yeah. not that. That doesn't accept water, that's hydrophobic. Yeah. Water can't go in there. It'll go through it. It might go through it, yeah. it might go through it, but it won't go through the biscuit. Yeah. I mean, if it goes through though, so I've said that, it may well then have an effect on its, on its effectiveness and run it. Belt and braces. That's, it, so it, how do you stop that from floating then? It doesn't. In the concrete, no? It used to, well you've got biscuit on top of it. So you, you, you pack it with biscuit? Yeah, one below and one below. Oh, so you've got two levels of biscuit on it? Yeah, but it, it did used to float in the concrete. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. 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 Uh, also, if the sofa is the game to start. Is that what you're telling me now, Steve? Is that what you're saying? Go on the YouTube channel, watching me. Make sure you like it. I'm going to watch it. Usually... What happens if you don't? If you get a like, does it happen? Do you just... I don't know how it works. I think it's... it's um, I think it just helps you get out there more to it, like, for people who are not subscribed. It raises up the... I suppose it raises up the, the search for Brit name. If, if there's one... If you, if YouTube analytics, if you can get a detail of that, you could spend some time on it yeah. and not read all the analytics on the, on the YouTube channel. And I try not to look at it because it's just so confusing. It's mind-boggling what... I'll bet, through their, their process of the it, I'll bet it's something to do with... Because I've got... Uh, my oldest works in that sort of environment, so does the partner. Yeah. In that same environment. And, and the daughter, husband works in that same department, same environment as well, all, all I've like seen. Yeah. Can't you do that? <laughs> Come on. Um, and yeah, they, 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 they are. Uh, so, what, what will probably happen, what, what I reckon will happen, is that they're. Um, it will, We'll see the amount of lights you've got, and it will pick out the lights, and I'll put them to the top of the thing, the same with Google searches. Yeah. The more people search something, and the more that one's at the top, the more it gets to the top. But people um, come on the slide as often, put dislikes on, but I can't do dislikes. It's all counted as a... Um, as a view. Yeah. You've been, they're interacting with the channel. Yeah. But you'll also get dislikes from uh, opposition. Yeah. yeah. So Google, so YouTube, it was the same as Google, the same company, isn't it? Yeah. They, they, they'll be aware that you're, you're going to do that. So it, and the same with TripAdvisor or wherever it is. Yeah. It's competition, isn't it? Yeah. We'll have to check the slab before we uh, prep it. What do you mean? The height. Oh yeah. So we're going to have to lift it up anyway. Okay. Two five five. Two fifty, but I'll leave five mil for insulation. There you have it. We're all squared up at. Four. Seven minutes to, not bad. Yeah. We've got an hour before it starts going too dark. We'll, well, we'll easy crack it, won't we? Alex just filling the holes up. Um, it's going to get covered with a hessian tonight for frost protection because we've had a couple of ground frost the last couple of nights. And yeah, we're ready to put the vertical damp in and get this block work round. So it's solid, solid, round to where Alex's left leg is, door, and then another little pillar there. So that should take long now. I'm gonna have a lot of more left over, but it's 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 dyed, it's dyed brown. So we can't just I didn't want to just do half a mix, which probably wouldn't have been enough. Anyway, I'm waffling now, let's get on with it.
There you go. I'm over here. Yeah, it's dark. I'm over here. When did the clocks go back? Not long. About four days ago? Yeah. This is our second pitch black finish. Luckily the house has got security lights, so we'd have struggled. We're gonna to have to get our Milwaukee lights out of the garage. Yeah. We don't like having them in the van just in case we need them, but we're struggling. Yeah, we've um, we've had such a, a bitty morning. We lost a whole morning right until one o'clock, didn't we? Yeah. So to be honest, we might not be able to work in the morning when it was raining. It was raining, yeah. So we've, either way, we've had a troublesome morning and we've had to make up for it in half an afternoon. Everything's been paid, everything's been ordered. Everything's getting delivered Monday, yeah. so we're organised now from today. And um, we've also looked into some nice fancy t-shirts, which we're going to get sorted out for our next project, next big project. Hey? Okay. Um, yeah, I can see you. This thing, this thing's meant to be good, isn't it? Right. But yeah, um, what we've done. we're up to damp. We've got it backed up with a weird 50 mil cavity. Yeah. It just doesn't feel natural. But uh, we've been allowed by the building inspector to use a 50 mil cavity to give us more we floor area. More space in the conservatory. Yeah, an extra extra 50 mil in the projection, extra 100 mil in the width. Uh, yeah, so we're coming back Sunday to get this all prepped. I have to remember the visqueen. Uh, Alex, has, as you can see, Alex has got one of the jabs there. There's a jab in the garage, and there's one in our garage. So, yeah, tomorrow. We're having a day off, the weather's not forecast very good and there's not much we can do here. And what we like to do, we like to usually give it like, if we can, we give it a day. So yeah. the block's nice and solid, so when we're doing the whacker in, yeah. it doesn't knock over the block work. Yeah, I've done that before. It's, 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 it, you know, when, if you're rushing it, it's no good. Yeah, and this mortar's quite wet as well, so it wouldn't be ready tomorrow. Mm. It's a shame, because if we'd, if we'd have started work this morning at 8 o'clock, we could have had that wall set out. Yeah. Had all the blues in. But, um, that's the way it goes, I'm afraid. So um, hopefully forward come early. No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what time anything on Monday. I just have to make sure I ring up to order the concrete tomorrow. Yeah. Get a load on for the afternoon. I think it's a cube. So right. Over and out. Okay.